Okay, this is a installation of the Airlift Wireless One compressor kit on a 2015 Toyota Tundra Crew Max. Uh, there's really not too many locations where to mount that compressor. What I did is I went to Lowe's and bought a piece of sheet metal that's six inches by 24, 16 gauge. I made a template where I'm gonna mount it, which was next to the charcoal canister. Uh, I folded the sheet metal in half just to thicken it up, make it stiffer. Here's my template, two holes. Anyways, it gets mounted right next to the charcoal canister. There's the two holes. Here's the notch I did for the brake line. As you can see, then everything gets mounted to that. Nice and solid. And the manifold, it's right here on the frame. There's two existing snow holes in the frame, so you don't have to drill. You bolt it right there. Uh, wrap all your wires in the wire loom. There's the fittings. It goes across to the other airbag. And it's a good thing to leave an extra line with the Schrader valve back here so you can manually fill and release the air if need to. I grabbed the power source right here from your trailer connector. I put a waterproof inline fuse. Uh, you can grab power from the black wire on your trailer connector. That is the charge wire for your trailer. So that's power only key on engine running. Again, hopefully this helps you where to decide to install the, your compressor setup. There's the Firestone airbags. Hopefully. Okay. Thanks for watching.